What up, what up, what up? This your boy, Boston. Welcome back to the channel. As always, I appreciate y'all coming through, kicking it with your boy, man. Just checking out the videos because you know the grind don't stop. And we is back with another video for you guys, man. So on today's video, as you read by the title and thumbnail, we got some fish that's breeding down here in the fish room. And we need to do something about it today because they're in their aquarium with other tank mates and it's not going so well. So we need to move some fish around, which is going to be pretty cool because we get to see some different fish in some different aquariums today. And we got to set this tank up for breeding just for them so that way they can produce and we can have tons of these babies and i can give them away to you guys or sell them whatever i decide i want to do but first let me show y'all these babies right here that i got on because they drippy right here yo i go cat let me show y'all these man we got the boss aquatic slides man you know what i'm saying got the little drip man so i've been working on my merch and stuff behind the scenes trying to find the right vendors to get y'all some swag man so let me know if you guys want me to produce these slides you know what i'm saying i got them on the feet right now let me back up a little bit Ooh, ooh, we got them on the feet they super comfortable though so let me know if you guys want me to start producing these slides man i'm trying to get the merch going man, because i want y'all to have some drip i don't want to just no plain regular stuff man we gotta have drip man we gotta be fly when we step out man so that's what we're working on today gonna show you guys the tank because they already laid some more eggs down there so i need to move some fish we got a lot to do so let's get into this video all right y'all so this is the aquarium that we are going to be working on today this is my 55 gallon community planted tank that is currently housing some tiger barbs we have some nice cherry barbs back here that male is looking really nice we got these beautiful australian rainbows really like this fish as well then we have these nice shell dwellers in here these uh brevises which i'm surprised we haven't been trying to breed up in here yet then we have a trio of these rosy barbs in here that have also bred for me before as well and then we have this trio of these pro garamis that are just beautiful i love the pro garamis just a beautiful fish definitely got a male and two females i've never tried to breed these guys but maybe in the future i will and then we got this long ranger angel fish in here as well then there's a bunch of like corys in here i think there's one julie cory back there hanging out and we have a bunch of bristle nose plecos in here as well but the fish that are steady trying to breed in here are my electric blue uh, cars this is my pair right here this is the female you can see her chasing off other fish right now and that is the male back here so as you see, these guys have laid some eggs and probably about 98% of them are fertilized, which is a good thing. And this is probably like the fourth time that they didn't lay eggs in this aquarium, twice that they hatched and both times they were eaten by, I would probably say the tiger barbs or anybody else in here that's fast. So what I wanna do is take all the other fish out of here. I probably end up leaving all the plecos in here and we'll leave all like the Julie Corys and things like that. But everything else in here, I wanna pull out this aquarium and move to different tanks. I got a lot of open tanks or tanks that it can be moved to. So we're gonna move some fish around today so that we can really get these guys going, man, because I got a beautiful pair. So we finally got all the fish out of the aquarium that I want to take out and we're going to be dispersing those guys between some different aquariums but thankfully I didn't have to destroy this tank to catch those fish out of here so only thing we got in here right now is our pair of electric blue cars you can see we got a nice male a final male bristle nose back there there's probably about five or six bristle nose plecos in here regular and a vinyl then we have our beautiful little Julie Corys in here just an awesome little fish so I really would like to bristle those plecos to take over this tank as well and start breeding in here. So hopefully we can get that going. I can already tell the pair is a lot more comfortable in here. So hopefully in the next three days or so, we should have some wigglers and these guys will be able to do what they do in here and not worry about predators. So now we need to move these fish to some new homes. And I was sitting here thinking, and I'm like, these beautiful electric blue cars will look amazing in this tank right here so i'm gonna put them guys in here and i think i'm going to move my angel fish in here and maybe my australian rainbow so let me catch these guys and we're going to release them we finally caught the fish let's go ahead and release these guys Ooh, look at the australian rainbow the electric blues angel fish nice Put a lot of debris in there. 
and now we added these guys in here with our jewels which are looking great loving that fish got our lecture blues in here nice little angel fish hanging about in the back look at this guy right here he is showing out ain't he looking great then we got our beautiful australian rainbows which is a very underrated fish in my opinion i really like that fish so this tank is definitely getting some more activity um hopefully all these fish in here will do well i think they will eventually i want to set up another big angel fish aquarium but this is the only angel i got other than my breeding pair that is down here hanging out right now which is a bad glare on it but that's what's going on in this tank right now now we need to figure out should we put any more fish in this tank i was kind of thinking maybe those cherry bars what you guys think i think the cherry barbs will look good in here as well so let's add the cherry barbs all right cherry barbs going in and that's a nice male in the female see the females are more browner with the gold stripe and the males are bloody red just an awesome fish a great fish for a planet community tank very peaceful and they will breed if you allow them to look at this male australian rainbow very underrated fish so yeah now this tank got some new inhabitants and we still want to get some rams for this tank but i think this is a great addition to this aquarium and it should add some more color and some more life to it so let me know what you guys think the next fish we're going to move are these rosy barbs and these tiger barbs and these guys are gonna go down to this empty 20 gallon aquarium for right now. Looking good. Definitely both underrated fish. Tiger barbs are definitely nippy. I just love tiger barbs, especially if you get a school of them, probably like 12 to 15 of these guys. They're just an awesome fish. And these rosa bars are pretty cool as well. Great for outdoor ponds or planted aquariums, and they will breed for you. So these guys are going to be living in here for a while until I set up another planted tank because I got some more community tanks up my sleeve. All right, so the next fish that we are getting are these pearl garamis. Just a very underrated, beautiful fish. And I'm going to be adding these guys down to this 20-gallon aquarium right here that has it's pretty much a community tank we have a betta in here which is very docile not mean at all we now got our pearl garamis in here and i believe there are six albino curbenses and then i think there's some random shrimp in here as well um so these guys are going to go in here and i think they'll add a lot more light to this tank because this tank is pretty boring to me uh, i can see one of the cribs right here high now so that's their new home for right now and then like i said once i set up another planet tank these guys will get a bigger home but yeah this was a definitely a successful day been wanting to do this for quite some time but i just haven't set the time to do it so i decided i might just record it for you guys but super excited to see these electric blue cars do what they do and we have 300 babies in here <laughs> in the next month or so so that's my plan so make sure you guys stay tuned for the updates on these guys and i'll definitely keep you informed where that little pleco go julie core is probably my favorite the stripings and the markings just beautiful little fish so that's gonna be pretty much it for today's content hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did make sure you hit that like button Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when I drop these videos because the grind don't stop and we always got videos coming for you guys, man. I'm always working. Even if I'm not posting, I'm filming. Even if I'm not filming, I'm working. The grind don't stop. I'm out of here. I'll catch you guys in the next one.